live from Jitex Technology Week 2021. This is me, Rabab Zera from TechX Media. I have with me Mr. Lawrence Essen, who is MD and CEO of Fina Technologies. Mr. Lawrence is a tech entrepreneur. He is a visionary executive with years of experience into supporting technology business in high growth industries. We will have a conversation with him about their participation in Jitex and what are the recent initiatives they have taken. So let's welcome Lawrence and TechX. Hi, Mr. Lawrence. How are you? Thank you very much for having me. Yeah, it's a pleasure. Uh, so obviously, let's start with this is your first year at Jitex. Yes. Uh, so why was it important for the for Fina Technologies to be a part of Jitex? And what are you showcasing at the event? Well, uh, to begin with, uh, Jitex is um, has become a global brand, a global platform. Yes, definitely. Um, for tech companies, especially startups like ours, mm -hmm. uh, to showcase to the world what we have to offer. Um, this year was the right time for uh, FEMA to come um, because we had just finished the development of, um, of our apps, um, suite of apps that we've been working on for the last 10 to 12 years. Uh, we've been involved in R&D and so the apps are now ready to be introduced to the world and we thought that the GTEx platform was the best platform to uh, make that introduction. So that's why we're here this year. Yes, and this is your first year as well. And this time, Jitex is also quite different from what we have experienced, what we experienced last year. So moving forward, what is uh, the concept behind <clears throat> um, uh, conversational artificial intelligence? What is that? Well, conversational um, AI or artificial intelligence um, is a concept of, of or, or describes the interaction between humans and machines. Uh, it uses natural language processing and machine learning. So the machines are taught to understand natural language and to interpret natural language. So that's why you have the NLP, the natural language processing and machine learning. So that's what it, um, conversational AI is all about. When machines and humans can interact and have a conversation intelligently. And, and, and that's what we basically consider our company to be, a natural language uh, AI company. Um, and uh, you have recently, uh, uh, you have also launched Luga uh, solution. So what is that? How is it benefiting enterprises? So please give us an overview of that. So Luga <coughs> is a, the name of the app that we've just released. Okay, it's an app. Um, okay. It's a suite of three apps. Mm -hmm. We have Luga Enterprise, Luga Entertainment, mm -hmm. and Luga Legacy. We've launched Luga Enterprise. Mm -hmm. um, from its name, Luga Enterprise is designed for enterprises. Um, it is designed to assist or to help enterprise in processing huge data in a conversational form with their customers or with their client base all over the world uh, on a near real-time basis. I'll give you an example. Um, today, if you wanted to buy an airline ticket, for example, and you made a phone call to say, uh, Emirates Airlines to buy a ticket online. Now, there's the possibility that we may be put on hold because of the volume of calls that's coming at the same time. And also because there are fewer people, live people, to respond to those calls. So what Luga Enterprise has done, that platform we've built, is it allows Emirates, for example, to process millions of phone calls that are coming in at the same time and to take each of those calls individually and attend to them. So if you called Emirates and I called and I wanted to go to Singapore and you wanted to go to Hong Kong, um, Luga would process your request and process my request separately but intelligently at the same time. So that is what we've built. That is what Luga Enterprise is designed to do for enterprises, which essentially is to make the enterprise a lot more efficient, to improve the quality of their products and their customer service uh, uh, processes as well. That, that's uh, interesting. So, um, uh, this is the first year uh, of Fina Technologies and uh, it's a startup company. So, uh, which other countries you are uh, targeting in Middle East and Africa region? And uh, what is the future roadmap for the company? So, the, the long term goal of Luga, of course, is a global market. Mm -hmm. um, but in the short to medium term, we're focusing our. Um, uh, our marketing on, on the Middle East and Africa. Mm -hmm. um, and the sectors that we're focusing on now are the financial sectors, banks and 
uh, insurance companies and the public sector and government as well. Uh, but in the long term, you know, the product is designed to serve the global market, the global you know, enterprises, multinational corporations. But for now, as I said, the target is for the UAE and Africa, and we're looking at the financial services industry, banks, insurance companies, and public sector, and the public sector. That's that's interesting, and thank you so much for being here with us. It was a pleasure talking to you. The pleasure is mine. Thank you so much for having us. Thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Stay tuned to TechX to know more about what is happening at Jidex Technology Week 2021. Goodbye.